Hello, Ted Greenfield, over 50 and learning to fly, and I've got one question for you right now. What is the difference from before to now? Okay, one more time. What's the difference from before till now? Now, I am a seaplane rated pilot. Yes, me, a seaplane rated pilot. And that means one thing, that you can do this too. It is convenient and it is all in one place. So I'm telling you, Jones Brothers is the place to do it. They're right here in Travaris, Florida. It's about an hour drive from Orlando. You can fly in, you can make it a great weekend. They've got hotels, one hotel's in walking distance. They've got a, another hotel that's really, really close driving distance and everything is right here it's almost too easy so Jones Brothers for your seaplane rating and if I can do it you can do it So the way they have got this set up is about as close to perfection that anyone can ask for. Like I said before, everything is in one place, from the hotels to the planes, even lunch options. It's all in walking distance and it's all right there. And Jones Brothers will provide you with everything you'll need for your check ride, from the oral to the practical. The first thing you start off with is about an hour of classroom instruction. Now, the classroom requires some effort, and you really will have to know this stuff before you get in the airplane. The book is a free download, and it contains just about everything you are going to need for the oral part of your check ride. And then, you get in the airplane. So come all the way back as we go into the water. Yeah, that's it. Uh, and we'll drop our water rudders so we can steer. And they are dropped. Cool. And now we're steering with our rudder pedals. That's right, and the stick is still full back. And wind is right behind us. Um, yep, but we'll go ahead and uh, we'll bring our gear up. Uh, and it's about a 45 minute, uh, 45 second to a minute cycle, so it's right. gonna take a little while. Yeah. We don't want to do a glassy water takeoff. Just be a normal, we'll do that later. Right, so we'll just do a normal um, takeoff, and that will be, um, We'll do a run up on the way out there. So uh, that will be uh, full throttle, first rise, second rise, get her down on plane, even her out, get that sight picture, accelerate, and then she'll come off. I can't remember my speeds. What were they? There's not a She flies when she flies. Okay. She um, just comes right off. Yep, on the takeoff, and um, you don't really, you're not going to rotate. There's no rotation. Yep. You just right. hold your sight picture until she and comes, just off comes up. And full power. And mix your full rich. Alright, so there's one rise. Keep this stick all the way back. There's your second rise. Let it come up on the step. Nice and easy. And there she goes. goes. Back pressure off. And there she goes. Alright, so you're on step. Fight for that sight picture. And got it. And wait for her to take off for you. Alright, airspeed's live. 50. Um, so let the, the nose is dropping a little bit. Keep See how the nose is dropping on yep. you? Fight for the there sight she picture. Goes. So that's your sight picture. Fight for it. As you speed up, the drag causes it to roll forward. If you fight for the sight picture, you'll have to increase Pull a little it back. Bit. But you're just doing it for sight picture, not for rotation. Yeah. All right, we get one notch of flaps up with good speed. That's right, 85. All right. There we go. Okay, and then we can bring a little bit of power back so we don't... Quite That's like 25 and 25. 25 over 25, yep. Right there, and then we'll roll that prop back. And right on that wind streak right there. Okay. There we go. So we'll do this one to a full stop. Okay. And I've got my point where I'm just going to get into ground effect, and then I'm just going to let the water come to me. And I'm, I've got a nice little gust that I'm just going into right here. You see it? Yep. There we go. I get that sight picture again. Chill, got plenty of time. All 
Alright, there's your side picture. Hold that side picture and work your power. Don't let the nose come up too high. Okay. No, a little lower on the nose. Lower on the nose. Got right it. there. There's your uh, side I got picture. it right there. And work your power. Fly onto the water. Keep your sight picture. No flaring. A little lower. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. Good. And we'll full stop. That was pretty good. Yeah. All right, water rotors are down. Procedure, keep the stick back, hose, everything good? Yep. All right. Okay, so next what we'll do is we'll do a rough water takeoff. All right, rough water takeoff. So we're going to be at 20 degrees flaps, 30. So rough water is the only one yep. that's at 30. Okay, everything else is at 20. So rough water's 30, uh -huh. nose up. Um, and basically it's a similar to a short field takeoff, right? Sort well, of. Um, and in a way, yes. It, how you fly it, though, is, is more like a soft field. Okay. Because the idea here is we're getting beat up on this rough water. Gotcha. We want to get up off that as rough water as soon as we can. That's, that 30 degrees of flaps helps us get off the water a little bit sooner. But it's also 30 degrees of flaps, so it's a lot of drag. So we want to stay in ground effect. Get at least that first notch of flaps in before we start trying to climb away. Right. So dump that first notch of flaps and let that airspeed come back up. Correct. Okay. While we're safely in ground effect. Okay. Yeah. Cool. All right. So we're right in there. So let's go gear up your farts or your flaps. 30 degrees of flaps up. Your area is clear. Yep. Your trim and stick back. Yep. All right. And we're good. You good. Yep. Okay. Now full power. And prop full forward, full power, and there she goes. There's one rise. That's one rise. Two rise. And keep, nope, let the nose keep coming down, or you're still looking for the same there sight picture. Go. That's right. There's your sight picture right there. Hold that sight picture. Don't let it change. Don't let the nose come down. All right, airspeed alive. So see the nose is dropping on you, yep. you gotta fight for that sight picture. There, there we, we go. go. There, she is. Okay, staying ground effect. Airspeed 60, 65. Yeah, you're good. So that's all I'm going to give you because if I were to give you any more, you'd already have your rating. And this should be everything you need to want to go get your seaplane rating. So give these guys a call. Look, when I was looking to do this, everyone I spoke to told me to go to Jones Brothers because they're the guys that you want to get your seaplane rating with. So their instruction is excellent. Their outfit is excellent, everything's all in one place, and you don't even need anything more. So I hope you loved it, I hope you watched it, I hope you learned something, and remember, if you're over 50, get out there and learn how to fly and get your seaplane rating.